Good morning. Guess what I learned today, if it worked. This morning, I learned to wait patiently and trust that Facebook is actually live streaming. This time I haven't checked it. I haven't checked the sound. I haven't gone back to make sure everything is okay. But I haven't given you this, oh, I don't know if I'm live yet. What's that? That's a victory for me in my confidence, in my professionality, in my learning by doing. But I'm not in my learning by doing group. That's Friday morning live. I'm not even in my dream job UN group. That's Wednesday morning live. Hello, this is Lily Gundaka, Oz, Lily, your Australian in Austria, sharing with you from the heart of Vienna to the world, to the wide, wide web, world wide web. I'm so happy and grateful to see you here, to be here myself. I've made progress. Even if you make only 1%, 1% a day, in 100 days, you'll have 100%. So why not start now? I did. I did. Just before going live, I started going through my videos. You may know me, you may know my profile. Let me tell you a little bit about myself. I'm a former data assistant for nuclear security at the International Atomic Energy Agency. My passion, apart from communicating with you, inspiring you, motivating you, is data, organizing information. So I want to have a record of my videos. I want to be able to tell you, this is live number 30, is it? I don't know. And should I separate? the Monday morning lives from the Wednesday morning lives and the Friday morning lives? Should I make a category Lily live, Oz Lily, here I am, learning by doing, dream job UN? I haven't answered those questions yet, but I managed in the title this morning to not just put Monday morning live, because as soon as I go live, I have the option to put in a title. What's going on here? I have an option to give you a summary. When I give you a title, you can figure out, do I want to watch this? Oh, another live from Lily. Not this time. But I want to know what I covered as well. Because in my Dream Job UN mentoring program, I have covered so much material and I'm still working on the paperwork, on the, on the substantial material to, to tell you what am I really doing? How do I really support you? If you are looking for a job at the UN, what is my process of motivating, of inspiring, of helping, of supporting, of clarifying? How can I help you get your dream job at the UN? So today, I wasn't finished. It's not perfect. I have not completed my list of all of my live videos. I haven't got dominion over 
Facebook and the way it controls and owns my video material. I have learnt the option to go into the video, to copy the link, to copy the embed code. And I've told you a number of times, I'm going to put it all on my homepage. So I'm step by step working on putting it together so that when you're in my Dream Job UN program, you can have access to each one of those motivational videos. And when I revive my blog, that I can cover all those other aspects. Gosh, on the weekend, I was active in another area, which is not covered by my blog or my Dream Job UN or my of learning by doing. And what I said on Sunday morning after my presentation was, I'm a public person. I'm looking forward to the recording so that I can share it. And that's me. I'm authentic. I'm real. I'm honest, unashamed. Well, actually, yeah, I do tend to feel, gosh, the video from last week where I'm filming, well, I'm walking to the meeting on Friday morning with my double chin, which always bothered me. And for a while there, I managed to, to trim it away. And of course, it depends a lot on how you present yourself. Where do you put the camera? What kind of makeup do you use? How do you dress yourself? But beyond all of those externals, do I really love myself? Can I show myself how I really am? Or do I need to hide myself forever because I'm too fat, too old, too unprofessional? Or can I beam out to you because I'm experienced? I'm a loving mother. I've learned to love my colleagues and my imperfections and the imperfections of those around me. I embrace life and I offer what I can give to you to make your life better. And when we recognize that despite our own inadequacies and imperfections, we can still and we can even help and support and complete one another. Take my relationship with my husband. We are not perfect, neither of us. What's the use of saying I'm better or he's better or she's better? or they're better. If we can't raise each other up and support and help one another, if you're at the top and you can't help me up, so what? I don't care. <laughs> but I've got something that you can learn from. And I know I can also learn from you. And even if I am mentoring you, I will grow. I'll get better. My next video will be even better. And there'll be even more people subscribe to my live stream, to my Facebook group, to me as a friend on Facebook. And right now, I haven't really found the option to download all the videos because what I've started doing is uploading the videos to YouTube so that I can use my YouTube channel. And I, uh, there was a lot going on last week and I've been convinced 
that YouTube is also a medium, a way to go for outreach. So Women's Federation who decided to focus on YouTube rather than the website, I'm starting to get convinced by the material that I heard last week that that could be true. However, you can't keep me down. I could not let the Women's Federation website just die away. And perhaps I'll even get the support I need to resurrect it effectively to really do what I want it to do. What I still want on the Women's Federation webpage is a calendar function so that you can find the events according to when they happened, a search function, and of course, all the other activities and issues that need to be resolved there, but they are my two key foci at the moment. So you can tell I'm very diverse. I'm involved in NGO activities, in UN activities, in public activities. I don't talk much about private activities out of respect for those who don't want me to publish their private situations. But I've got a life and I'm happy to share with you, to inspire, to uplift, to engage. And that was Monday morning live from Oz Lily. So have a great week.